So I just got this in and I'm just gonna, it's more a look at, I can't show you the movie because of copyright rules. But it, they were, it was not special, it was one of their daily deals. It was a notice from Honey in regards to a, a reduced price. So I think they were going for about $300, so I never purchased it, but now they actually just sold for, I got it for like $199. And it's a hundred movies, and what I'm doing in this video is just showing you how they come. So it comes in this plastic, big heavy box. It's 55 discs, so I'm assuming, you know, it's one to two movies per DVD. And I guess at 200, you got 100 movies, we're talking about $2 each. And it's great. It's, you know, having a collection uh, that's all the information on, I guess, all the movies right here. Uh, what is this? Okay. So this is all the information on the cover. Let's make sure the DVDs are in hot, good quantities. Oh, my favorite uh, actor. I was present. Loved him. Loved him. Been to his house. Pretty cool in uh, Tennessee. I took my wife. She loved it. <laughs> uh, I, got to, I heard that they opened up the upstairs, so I gotta go there again so I can check it out. When I went, I believe in the 90s I went, his, an aunt of his was still living there. Interesting thing, I didn't know that he was buried there. Uh, I don't know what these are. I guess I have this at the end so I can show it to you. Uh, piece of cardboard. Oh, it came in this envelope here. And this is some information on the movies that come inside. The uh, box. This is a big poster. Uh, okay. I guess this is a poster of all the posters of the movies when they came out. A small version of, I'm going to have to read this out and go really far away, but it's a poster of all the posters of the movies that are here. So I'll put this to the side and I'll stand up on my chair so I can give you a better look at what's on there. Okay, so it has that. And, uh, my favorite actor, Mr. Elvis Presley. Oh, it's like an album. Oh, pretty cool. So it's, it's two of these, volume one, 1927 to 1968. Cool. I've seen a lot of these movies already, but it's nice to re-see them again. This is volume one. Let me just show you real quick. Volume two, are these all the same pic? No, different pictures. So volume two is a collection from 1968 to 2013. These are a lot of our modern movies. Shawshank Redemption, that was a great movie. I think there's Hangman or 
hangover, hangover. And oh, Bruce Lee, Enter the Dragon. That was a great movie. Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory. Clinton, I mean, uh, Dirty Harry, uh, Clint Eastwood. You make some great movies. This is how it's going to look. Oh, John Wayne. Some information on the movies inside. Uh, and I guess where are the DVDs? Uh, they're here. Okay. Oh, okay. That's that. That. And the DVD is here. The public enemy. Pull out a couple of the DVDs to see how what condition they're in. Not bad. They look good. Hopefully, they play well. the wind. Viva Las Vegas. I love that, uh, this guy.
I'm going to pull out a couple of discs in the middle. Just to make sure that, that the discs are in good condition. They're kind of stuck in there, I'll tell you that much. Wear a pair of gloves like I'm wearing so that you don't damage and scratch them. So they seem pretty good now. So no issues whatsoever. Uh, let me pull out another one just to make sure. No issues whatsoever. So. This is the second volume. <clears throat> this is the uh, newest versions or the later versions. Okay, let me just pull out one of the DVDs, make sure it's okay on the second volume book. I'll pull out a couple of more later. And uh, this one. I'm giving it about 10 seconds a page. Caddyshack. Let me try another one of the discs just to make sure that it's in good condition. I've never seen that one clash of the Titans, so we'll try uh, in the next one. Let's see. Oh, The Outsiders. I loved this movie. This was such a good movie. Chariots of Fire. And now, <clears throat> hey, risky business. And National Lampoon's Vacation. There's another one, looks good, no issues whatsoever. I'll just double check all the discs, and at the end, I'll let you know um, how the movies or the DVDs condition are. This is a movie too. I saw this also. I don't remember if I, re I, I, if I, I don't think I remember it clearly, but I saw that movie. It's pretty good.
This movie was so good, I can only watch it once. It just broke my heart that much. It was such, it was too much to bear. Yeah, I couldn't, it was so sad. It was just uh, really sad. It was a great movie, it got me, but it was so sad, I felt so bad for her. Oh, and the whole Lord of the Ring trilogy. I believe I watched that all already. Definitely show the end. I watched some of 300. Not too much, but some of it. Seen this one? Inception. Never even heard of it. Uh oh, that's not good. Uh, it's got glue on it. Ah. Oh, let's hope the rest are not like that. I'm gonna have to go through all of them. Let's hope it still plays. I have a cleaner, so let's hope that plays. That's not good. What is the bonus disc? This one seems fine. I'm gonna have to go through all of them and I'll let you know. Yay or nay on the condition. I'm worried about the conditions. It is 55 disc. There's a higher ratio of uh, bad disc. So again, it comes in two, volume two, volume one. Let me do, uh, let me raise the phone to so get a really good look at everything that comes inside. So these are the two sets that come with actual DVDs. That's the cover, some information, like postcards. An envelope with where you hold that, the actual Time Warner box itself, showing the 100 disc. And then this is, like I told you, the poster of the posters. Come up high, get a better idea. So, this would be pretty cool to hang up. I haven't hung up a poster in years. We used to hang up posters all the time in my room. Nobody does that anymore. I would hang them up all the time. I had a friend who was in the movie theater business and I would sometimes get the old posters and I could hang them up, which was really, really cool. Wish I would have kept them. So that's everything. All right, now let me just check the disc and I'll come back and let you know if they're in good condition. I'm gonna have to check each and every single one, so it'll be a while. It'll be, it's funny because I'm gonna take about a week or two to figure that out, but you'll see it just after this. So, I'm finishing up the video here. It's been about, uh, I'd say about two and a half weeks since, uh, I got this and my thing was that I did read under some of the reviews that people were having problems with some of the disc being messed up and they're right. I had about five discs that were almost unplayable. Uh, it took me a long time to clean them up. I finally got, uh, I think about three of them to play. The other two is they play, 
but you could see that it catches at a certain point with the laser and it either skips or gets stuck and it just freezes the movie. You kind of got to fast forward it. And you know, you're, you want all the movies to work. So they come in disc. I should have shown you the mo uh, the actual, um, I should have kept a record of which movies didn't play well. For example, this one disc I just pulled out, you can see right at the tip, right there. Not all of them, not all of them. Most of them were fine, but I might've gotten lucky and just picked the correct one. This is one of the ones that skips. So, you know, you do have those issues. It is dual sided, so it's very difficult to handle. And you gotta grab it through the middle. You don't leave too many fingerprints or what have you. And um, I had one that had a, a bunch of these going across. So clearly, um, you know, you'll have some issues with uh, some of the discs. But I got three of them to play. Two of them, you know, you have to deal with the headache. So, and the sad part is I haven't even gone through the whole movie. So what I did was, just to test them and make sure that they at least played and worked, was I tried each and every single movie and played it for 30 minutes and uh, made sure that they continued to play. So it was a lot of work to just test that. So I, it ranged between 30 minutes. Sometimes I got caught up in certain movies. I might've gone an hour. Uh, there was a couple I did finish, but most of them I did not finish. And it's, um, it's a great pack. I mean, I got it for 197 or 199. You can get the info below. It was, I think it was one of their daily deals. And it was a great price. Pretty much, I paid like $2 per movie. You get 55 disc dual-sided. And they have extras. So they'll have things like um, uh, Warner Brothers back, you know, you know, different things. Uh, some of the disc, you know, as you add it up, um, uh, 55 disc or 55, di 55 times two is 110, but you don't get 110 movies. Some of these discs, the movies were so long that they took two sides. So the one disc, most discs were two movies, one on each side, some were one movie. Like I think Lord of the Rings uh, was uh, an example. It was a long movie, so they were on both sides. So you'll get things like that. <clears throat> and that's why there are 55 dual sided discs and each disc has something on each side. So I guess they ran, um, they did put in Warner Brothers back lot uh, tour and another Warner Brothers behind the scenes type of thing. So, you know, I really like these movies. One of my, you know, one, one of the movies I'm really excited to see is The Outsiders. I remember as a kid watching that and that was a great movie with Ralph Macchio from back in the day. And that was pretty cool before he got famous with Karate Kid. Um, so it comes out to about $2 a movie, and it's a nice collection to have. It really is. And most of them played. I double-checked them to make sure that I didn't have to go back and return it and get a different set. I'm going to keep this set because I don't want to get another set and find out that they're even worse. So you might run into the issue of, you know, they got like sticky substance, like uh, the wrapping or the glue that is used to keep the disc in place, it's gonna happen. You have a you have 55 discs dual sided, which is very you know sensitive. I wish, I mean, it would have been much bigger. But if it would have been one sided, at least you would have had one disc you could have put up against the area that had the glue substance. But because it's dual sided and you have two, one movie on each side, it's very it's very uh, susceptible to. Uh, glue and all that other stuff that is used to wrap these things to contain these things so uh, you know it's just one of the things you have to live with but I like it I like the whole setup I'm happy with it I'm gonna keep it two dollars a movie it's not about bad price I really really liked it all right so I hope the video helps I hope you liked it thank you bye some info on item best of Warner Bros 100 film collection DVD, various actor, director rated, NR format, DVD, the 21st of September 2020. Cost, $199.99.
purchased on Amazon website. Editorial reviews the world's largest film collection from a major studio. 100 movies including all 22 of Warner Bros. Library's Best Picture winners on 55 discs presented in book style premium packaging. Plus two all new documentaries. Tales from the Warner Bros. Lot and the Warner Bros. Lot 2 up. With hours of commentaries, behind the scenes featurettes and more on select films. Also includes a limited edition 27 inches x 40 inches post. Plus a postcard series of Warner Bros. movie posters designed by legendary Bill Gold. Look for these movie poster titles on DVD. Films include. 1. The Jazz Singer 1927. 2. Broadway Melody of 1929. 1929. 3. The Public Enemy. 1931. 4. Cimarron. 1931. 5. Grand Hotel 1932. 6. 42nd Street 1933. 7. Mutiny on the Bounty. 1935. 8. A Night at the Opera 1935, 9. The Great Ziegfeld, 1936, 10. The Life of Emil Zola, 1937, 11. The Adventures of Robin Hood 1938, 12. Dark Victory 1939, 13. Gone with the Wind 1939, 14. Wizard of Oz 1939, 15. The Philadelphia Story 1940, 16. The Maltese Falcon 1941, 17. Cities on Kane 1941, 18. Mrs. Miniver, 1942, 19. Casablanca, 1943, 20. Yankee Doodle Dandy 1942, 21. Gaslight, 1944, 22. Anchors Away, 1944, 23. Mildred Pierce, 1945, 24. Best Years of Our Lives 1946, 25. The Big Sleep 1946, 26. The Treasure of the Sierra Madre, 1948, 27. An American in Paris 1951, 28. A Streetcar Named Desire 1951, 29. Singing in the Rain 1952, 30. Seven Brides for Seven Brothers 1954, 31. A Star is Born 1954, 32. East of Eden, 1955, 33. Rebel Without a Cause 1955, 34. Around the World in 80 Days 1956, 35. Giant 1956, 36. The Searchers, 1956, 37. A Face in the Crowd 1957, 38. Cat on a Hot Tin Roof 1958, 39. Giggy 1958, 40. Ben-Hur, 1959, 41. North by Northwest 1959, 42. How the West Was Won 1962, 43. Whatever Happened to Baby Jane, 1962, 44. Viva Elias Vegas 1964, 45. Doctors Hivago, 1965, 46. Who's Afraid of Virginia Woolf? 1966, 47. Cool Hand Loop 1967, 48. The Dirty Dozen 1967, 49. 2001, A Space Odyssey, 1968, 50. Bullet, 1968, 51. The Wild Bunch 1969, 52. Dirty Harry 1971, 53. Willy Wonker and the Chocolate Factory 1971, 54. Cabaret, 1972, 55. A Clockwork Orange 1972, 56. Enter the Dragon 1973, 57. The Exorcist, 1973, 58. Blazing Saddles, 1974, 59. Dog Day Afternoon 1975, 60. One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest 1975, 61. All the President's Men 1976, 62. Superman, The Movie 1977, 63. Kadishak, 1980, 64. The Shining 1980, 65. Clash of the Titans 1981, 66. Chariots of Fire 1981, 67.
National Lampoon's Vacation 1983, 68. The Outsiders 1983, 69. The Right Stuff 1983, 70. Risky Business 1983, 71. Amadeus 1984, 72. The Color Purple 1985, 73. The Goonies 1985, 74. Full Metal Jacket 1987, 75. Lethal Weapon, 1987, 76. Batman 1989, 77. Driving Miss Daisy 1989, 78. Goodfellas, 1990, 79. The Bodyguard 1992, 80. Unforgiven, 1992, 81. The Fugitive, 1993, 82. Interview with the Vampire 1994, 83. Natural Born Killers, Director's Cut 1994, 84. Shawshank Redemption 1994, 85. 7 1995, 86. L.A. Confidential 1997, 87. The Matrix 1999, 88. Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone 2001, 89. Lord of the Rings, The Fellowship of the Ring 2001, 90. Lord of the Rings, The Two Towers 2002, 91. Lord of the Rings, The Return of the King 2003, 92. The Notebook, 2004, 93. Million Dollar Baby 2005, 94. The Departed 2006, 95. 300, 2007, 96. The Dark Knight 2008, 97. The Blind Side 2009, 98. The Hangover, 2009, 99. Sherlock Holmes 2009, 100. Inception 2010. Product details is discontinued by manufacturer. Norm per rating. SMED not rated and are not rated. Product dimensions. 11.5 x 8.2 x 4.6 inches. 10.05 pound sitem model number. 2 crore 61 lakhs 93,165 director, very house media format, NTSC, box set, color, limited edition roller assa date, January 29, 2013 actors, very house studio, Warner Brothers as in, B009L0H4F4 number of discs, 55. Number of discs 55. Films include 1. The Jazz Singer. 1927, Broadway Melody of 1929, 1929, 3. The Public Enemy, 1931, Cimarron, 1931, 5. Grand Hotel, 1932, 42nd Street, 1933, 7. Mutiny on the Bounty, 1935, 8. A Night at the Opera, 1935, 9. The Great Ziegfeld, 1936, The Life of Emil Zola, 1937, The Adventures of Robin Hood, 1938, Dark Victory, 1939, Gone with the Wind, 1939, Wizard of Ounce, 1939, The Philadelphia Story, 1940, the Maltese Falcon, 1941, Citizen Kane, 1941, Mrs. Miniver, 1942, Casablanca, 1943, Yankee Doodle Dandy, 1942, Gaslight, 1944, Anchors Away, 1944, Mildred Pierce, 1945, Best Years of Our Lives, 1946, The Big Sleep, 1946, The Treasure of the Sierra Madre, 1948, An American in Paris, 1951, A Streetcar Named Desire, 1951, Singin' in the Rain, 1952, Seven Brides for Seven Brothers, 1954, A Star is Born, 1954, East of Eden, 1955, Rebel Without a Cause, 1955, 
Around the World in 80 Days, 1956, Giant, 1956, The Searchers, 1956, A Face in the Crowd, 1957, Cat on a Hot Tin Roof, 1958, Gigi, 1958, Ben-Hur, 1959, North by Northwest, 1959, How the West Was Won, 1962, Whatever Happened to Baby Jane? Viva Las Vegas, 1964, Dr. Zhivago, 1965, Who's Afraid of Virginia Woolf? Cool Hand Luke, 1967, The Dirty Dozen, 1967, 2001, A Space Odyssey, 1968, Bullet, 1968, The Wild Bunch, 1969, Dirty Harry, 1971, Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory, 1971, Cabaret, 1972, A Clockwork Orange, 1972, Enter the Dragon, 1973, The Exorcist, 1973, Blazing Saddles, 1974, Dog Day Afternoon, 1975, One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest, 1975, All the President's Men, 1976, Superman, The Movie, 1977, Caddyshack, 1980, The Shining, 1980, Clash of the Titans, 1981, Chariots of Fire, 1981, National Lampoon's Vacation, 1983, The Outsiders, 1983, The Right Stuff, 1983, Risky Business, 1983, Amadeus, 1984, The Color Purple, 1985, The Goonies, 1985, Full Metal Jacket, 1987, Lethal Weapon, 1987, Batman, 1989, Driving Miss Daisy, 1989, Goodfellas, 1990, The Bodyguard, 1992, Unforgiven, 1992, The Fugitive, 1993, Interview with the Vampire, 1994, Natural Born Killers, Director's Cut, 1994, Shawshank Redemption, 1994, 7, 1995, L.A. Confidential, 1997, The Matrix, 1999, Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone, 2001, Lord of the Rings, The Fellowship of the Ring, 2001, Lord of the Rings, The Two Towers, 2002, Lord of the Rings, The Return of the King, 2003, The Notebook, 2004, Million Dollar Baby, 2005, The Departed, 2006, The Dark Knight, 2008, The Blind Side, 2009, The Hangover, 2009, Sherlock Holmes, 2009, Inception, 2010. <laughs>